I would like to welcome you all to this introduction geography lesson on the world famous city, Sydney. Each student will be creating a project on Sydney throughout this series of lessons. What do you currently know about Sydney? What do you think it would be like to go to school there? Sydney is the largest and most populous city in Australia and the state capital or province as we know in Ireland of New South Wales. Sydney is located on Australia's southeast coast of the Tasman Sea. Do you know what inhabitants of Sydney are called? Inhabitants of Sydney are called Sydney Siders, comprising a cosmopolitan and international population of people from numerous places around the world. The site of the first British colony in Australia, Sydney, was established in 1788 at Sydney Cove by Mr Arthur Phillip. The city is built on hills surrounding Port Jackson, which is commonly known as Sydney Harbour, where the iconic Sydney Opera House and the Harbour Bridge are featured prominently. The surrounding areas of the city is surrounded by national parks and the coastal regions feature many bays, rivers, inlets and beaches, including the world famous Bondi Beach. Within the city are many notable parks including Hyde Park and the Royal Botanical Gardens. Sydney ranks among the top 10 livable cities in the world. Sydney has a reputation as an international centre for commerce, arts, fashion, culture, entertainment, music, education and tourism. Sydney has hosted major international sporting events including the 2000 Summer Olympics and the final match of the 2003 Rugby World Cup. The picture you have all been looking at is a beautiful sunset of Sydney. Australia, officially the Commonwealth of Australia, is a country in the Southern Hemisphere, comprising the mainland of the Australian continent, the island of Tasmania and numerous smaller islands in the Indian and Pacific Oceans. Sydney, the unofficial capital, is located on Australia's southeast coast of the Tasman Sea. Do you know the official capital of Australia? How many kilometres do you think Sydney is from Dublin? Can you see exactly where Sydney is on the map? Who would like to guess at what iconic building this is? Who has seen this building before? Who knows what it is called? What do you know about this building? What do you think it looks like? Do you think it was difficult to build? The previous picture for anybody who guessed correctly was indeed the Sydney Opera House under construction. The Sydney Opera House is located in Circular Quay in downtown Sydney. It was completed in 1973 and was designed by Jorn Utzon. The acoustics or sounds are fabulous. From outside the Sydney Opera House looks remarkable and if you get up close you'll be able to see several of the million or so ceramic tiles which cover the Sydney Opera House. The Opera House hosts four auditoriums or stages showcasing or showing music, ballet, theatre and film productions and every New Year's Eve there is a world famous remarkable firework display that lights up the sky. Would you agree or disagree it is a wonderful backdrop? Would you like to visit it? The Sydney Harbour Bridge, also known affectionately as the Coat Hanger, was opened on March 19, 1932, after six years of construction. In the previous photo, you all got a glimpse of the bridge of construction. Made of steel, the bridge contains six million hand-driven rivets. The surface area that requires painting is equal to about the surface area of 60 football pitches. The bridge has huge hinges to absorb the expansion caused by the hot Sydney sun. You will see them on either side of the bridge at the footings of the pylons. If you get a chance to go to Sydney, you can have a close look while you are there by visiting the southeastern pylon. It is a walking trip and recommended for the fit only. It's also a longish walk to get to the base of the pylon and then there are 200 steps to the top. 
The views and photo opportunities are fantastic. It has a similar place in Sydney history to the Statue of Liberty in New York, as far as many migrants go to Australia. In sight of the bridge, you knew you had made it. The old bridge has been replaced at the landmark of Sydney by the bold architecture of the Opera House that you saw on the previous photo. Sydney Harbour Bridge is the world's largest steel arch bridge and, in its beautiful harbour location, has become a renowned international symbol of Australia. Would you like to climb it? Do you know any other famous bridges in the world? This is the beautiful, striking skyline of Sydney. This photo was taken from the eastern side of Sydney, known as the Rocks. Can you see how tall the buildings are there? Do we, in Ireland, have any similar structures? Can you see the outline or shadow of the Sydney Upper House to the left of the photograph? After the Sydney Upper House, this photo is the second largest tourist attraction in Sydney. This beach is known worldwide as Bondi Beach. Bondi Beach is located on the eastern suburbs of Sydney and accessible from the city centre in 20 minutes. It has fantastic waves for surfers and thousands upon thousands of people flock here every single day. Bondi itself is quite residential and very very famous with backpackers from all over the world. Another fantastic world famous beach I would like to draw your attention to is that of Manly Beach. After Bondi Beach, which you saw on the previous slide, Manly Beach is the second largest and second busiest beach in Sydney. Manly is located 7 kilometers from Circular Quay, that which we have learnt is the location of the Sydney Opera House. Manly Beach is full of attractions and exciting activities including Manly Beach Ocean World, swimming, tennis, golf, beach volleyball. Can you think of any other activities which tourists may play here? Manly is the perfect destination for your Sydney escape. We cannot talk about Sydney without talking about sport. Sydney ciders and Australians in general love their sport. Due to the fantastic hot climate mainly all year round, they are most definitely at an advantage. Do you know any sports they may play? Do you know who the Wallabies are? Do you know any famous Australian sports stars? Rugby, tennis and Aussie rules are home to some of the most world famous teams predominantly based in Sydney including the Sydney Swans, Leighton Hewitt, and Rugby Union's Sydney Eagles. Can you recall from the start of the presentation what year the Olympics were held? In this photo, you can see the local derby of Wallabies versus the All Blacks, or Australia versus New Zealand, in the Beslow Cup in Homebush in ANZ Stadium, which is part of the, one of the stadiums where the Olympics were held. I would like to leave you all now with this striking image of Sydney at night. I hope I have given you some useful information to construct your project.